there's no salvation for the Facebook expert, according to me. And and we'll take this, and you can see that these these links here all go to other articles that we've written. It's no one's paying for it. We're doing it because these are actually good articles, right? So if you look at any one of these, you guys know Adweek. A lot of people, yeah. uh, we're not in marketing, don't know what that is. So here you can see, like I clicked on this. Now it goes to another blog post I have. This blog post was almost four years ago, right? And so I'm amplifying this thing here. I've got my plumbing in place, meaning I've got my Facebook pixel. I've got the Google pixel. I've got these other pieces. And every time we get citations, we keep track of them. This is where you need an assistant or a couple assistants. We have teams of people to do this. So that when we when we publish articles, it could be business community, it could be whatever, we are tracking them behind the scenes. We're tracking mentions. We're tracking articles we're about to make. We're tracking endorsements. Right? And these are all things that will continue to, you know, speaking. Those core ones not filled out. Pictures with your client and all these other people that they're with, including links and these kinds of things. And then you just keep them. Every time you, you, you catch these things, so I come here, notifications. <clears throat> like I'll tweet something. And people will, you know, retweet it. You can automate things. A lot of people who do personal branding, they like to automate. I, I really don't like to do that. It, yes, it works, but for many reasons, I think it's inauthentic, and people will catch you doing these things. But someone has to come in here and be able to monitor when you get a high-profile one and stick it in your sheet. 